Hi guys, this is Mekha Verma. Welcome back to my channel. So in today's tutorial, we will learn how to design the social media post in Corel Draw. So without any delay, let's get started. So this is the size of our social media post. Now first we will select the rectangle tool from the toolbar and we will draw a square. Now we will set the size of the square 2000 pixels by 2000 pixels. Now we will set the align of the square. First we will click on specified point then align center horizontally and align center vertically. Now we will select this square and we will select interactive fill tool from the toolbar and we will apply. Now we will select fountain fill, then we will select elliptical fountain fill. Now we will set the colors, now you can see the color codes which I am using in this design. Now we will remove the outline by right click. Now we have these two images, now we place this. Now first we will select the mobile image and we will place. Now we will adjust the size. Now we will drag and right click to make a copy of the image. Now we will place here. Now we will select both images and we will press C to align center. Now we will select this. Now we will select the option mirror vertically. Now we will select the transparency tool from the toolbar and we will apply like this. Now we will increase the transparency. Now we will right click and we will select power clip inside now click on the square. Now we will select this background image and place this. We will increase the size and we will place on the background like this. Now we will select the common shapes from the toolbar. Now we'll select this one. Now we'll draw. Now we'll remove the outline and we will fill color. Now we'll make a copy by drag and right click. Now we'll press Ctrl R to make one more copy. Now we'll select this. Now we'll select Contour tool from the toolbar. And we will apply. Now we'll right click and we'll select Break Contour Apart. Now we'll change the color. Now we'll select the inner shape and we will adjust. Now we'll change the color. Now we'll select ellipse tool from the toolbar and we will draw a circle. Now we'll fill color. Now we'll drag inside with the shift key then right click to make a copy. Now we'll select interactive fill tool. Now we'll select fountain fill then elliptical fountain fill. Now we will set the colors. Now we will adjust the size. Now we'll remove the outline.
Now again we will select the rectangle tool and we will draw a small rectangle. I will select round corner option. I will select shape tool from the toolbar and we will round the corners like this. Adjust the size. Now again we will select the contour tool from the toolbar and we will apply on this shape. I will right click and we will select break contour apart. I will select the inner shape and we will change the color. I will select both and we will remove the outline. Now we have all these details. Now we'll place this one by one. First we will place the logo. Now change the color of the logo. Now place this text and we will give a white color. Select the block shadow tool from the toolbar and we will apply on this text. Now we'll change the color of the shadow. Now we'll place this text. I'll place this text in the circle. We'll click with the circle and we'll press C to align center. I'll place this text in these shapes and we will change the color. I'll place the website in the bottom. Now here we will place the social media icons. Now we will adjust the text. Now first we will change the size of the text. Now we will select the shape and we will press it to align center. Select all and we will drag with the arrow key. Now we will adjust the text and the social media icons. Now select both and press E to align. Now again we will Select the ellipse tool and we will draw over like this. Now fill color. Now we'll go to the effects menu and we will select plus then Gaussian plus. Now we will adjust the radius size. 
then ok now place here I will do control page down to send back now adjust the size now again we will adjust the radius Select the circle and we will select shadow tool from the toolbar and we will apply. Now select the shape and we will apply shadow. apply on this text so guys our social media post design is ready i hope you like the design if you have any question regarding this tutorial you can ask me on the comment box please like share and comments and if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get updates of my videos thanks for watching